Hello, today I'm going to be doing a Vibely tutorial. It was requested by someone on my TikTok page. So, I really hope this helps. Let's get into the video. First, I'm going to open up GarageBand. I'm going to make a song. If you want a full tutorial on how to do that, just comment. I'm just going to record the song. Once I'm finished, I'll exit out and name my song, so it'll be easier to find. I'm going to press and hold down on my song, then click share. Then I'll click song. Make sure the audio quality is uncompressed wave. Once you have, then click share. Next, you are going to press open in under Mac. Wait until your song is exported. Then click save to files. You can save it to any file of your choosing, but once you have it, press save. Next, we're going to the Vibly app. On the bottom left, there's a plus button. Click that and click files. Go to recents or the file you place your song in, then click your song. Once my song is added, I like to make sure that it's all there. Once I check everything, I go to my drawing app. I use IBS Paint X, where I have already made a cute background picture. The best dimensions that fit the Vibely vertical frame is 1998 by 2972. And 2972 by 1998 fit the horizontal frame. Now I'll save my drawing. Then go back to the Vibely app. On the bottom bar, swipe left and go to Image, then press Select. Once selected, press Library. Once your photos appear, select your drawing. Now that you have your drawing and music, I'd suggest just playing around with the buttons. Each one is labeled how it functions. Of course, you don't have to use a drawing. You can always take a picture from online. The process is exactly the same. When it comes to the inserting of the unknown artist and unknown title, I'd suggest just using a different app for the text because there isn't a wide variety of fonts. But if you want to use Vibly for their fonts and text, that's okay too. Once finished with all of my edits, I like to take one last look at it to make sure everything's okay. Once I've confirmed everything's to my liking, I press the top right export button. There are different settings for resolution and frames per second. I do suggest 30 frames per second and HD 720p because it's a nice in-between for everything. Then press sounds good once you got everything together and you'll watch a quick ad, which I won't let you suffer through. Now you'll wait until your song is exported. The video is automatically saved to your camera roll. I'll press done and then here's the results.